What do you think is the, the greatest misconception by a person thinking that, oh, I can just, you know, take some nice pictures of my home and throw the pictures up there on, on you know, the internet and I'm going to get a full sure. price offer? Sure. So, so there's a couple of things to that. So, so one of them is a lot of sellers rely on online valuations for the estimate of their home. So that can lead to two different things. One of them is they will greatly underestimate the value of their home, therefore leaving thousands of dollars on the table. Or number two, they can overestimate the value of their home and then they leave, you know, then they're on the market for days and days on end. Um, some of the other things is, you know, yes, you can't just take pictures with your phone and throw it up on you know the for sale by owner um, websites or whatnot um, and you've also got to consider you know how much exposure are you getting so there's certain real estate companies that you go with that you know you're you're exposed to over 350 different websites to advertise your property um, so professional pictures the staging the photography um, and the you know the contracts, um, flyers, brochures, signage. I mean, the the it just goes on and on. The list goes on and on. Uh, it certainly does, and we want to encourage our viewers to reach out to you to sell and list their home because coming from a person who recently went through it, it is not something that you want to do on your own. Sarah, thank you so much for being on with us today. Thank you so much, Jen.